Um, my son was diagnosed when he was about two and a half, almost three. I knew something wasn't right. I couldn't hit my son. I couldn't put him on my hips. And he would complain a hundred times a day that his legs hurt and he couldn't walk. A mm -hmm. hundred times a day his legs hurt. Mommy, my legs hurt. I can't walk. Um, wouldn't socialize with children. Energy level was nothing was there. He'd want to be in bed at six o'clock at night. And then the doctors did a blood, blood work on him and came back with the diagnosis of Duchenne's muscular dystrophy. They told me the prognosis um, wasn't good. Enjoy my, time, my son's time out of a wheelchair. Um, told me they would give me a steroid and sit back and wait for this to happen. I went home and of course we were devastated and did research and I took the steroids and I put them in the cupboard and I decided I would go for stem cell to see what exactly worked. And I just went forward and said, you know what, I can't get my son any sicker. All I can do is get him better and what more can I give my son other than new life? And um, five hours after treatment, my son was able to walk up three stairs on his own without holding on to anything. Within a week, he was bending his knees. I described my son as Pinocchio. He was a little wooden boy. My son doesn't complain that his legs hurt anymore. And he's still able to run, play with normal children, interact with normal children. My son couldn't dance. I never seen my son dance until after the first round of stem cell. He was able to bend his knees. He wasn't like a little wooden Pinocchio anymore. It gives my son fire and gives him the ability to have the quality of life that he deserves. And every child that I've met with this disease, between ages 8 and 12, every child I've met is already in a motorized wheelchair. They're on steroids. They're very lethargic. They've got no energy. Their moods are high and low and all over the map. With my son, I don't have that. I have a happy little boy that enjoys life. He went fishing for the first time the other week, caught his first fish, um, he rides a bike, he goes on a go-kart, um, he, he's able to do stuff that children are supposed to do. So I feel how dare somebody take the quality of life that my son deserves.